So guys, today, this is a different type of video, I'm going to be re reviewing the MTL Dune. I have actually seen this by a lot of other YouTubers, but I didn't, I've only seen, say, a few seconds of the videos because, um, that's not really my type of thing that I like watching on YouTube, but then I did actually watch it in the end and I thought it was pretty good to be honest. But um, today I'm going to be making a video on it. Basically, I'm going to review, review and see what's uh, see what's good about it, see what's bad about it, and yeah, guys. So let's start off with the um, see how good the glass will protect you. Say if you're getting shot by this random person for no, for no reason. So say if they're using a pistol. Uh, I'm using a pistol right now. It's the original pistol since the game came out it's got no suppressor suppress suppressor on it well it's basically it's got no attachments on it but um as you can see where you do go and shoot it it does actually protect you a little bit so it takes about three shots until the the glass does start to shatter but then as you can see it still is protecting you a little bit because there aren't actually any holes in it yet it takes around about say th five to six shots before it does actually start a bullet hole in the glass. Now let's move on to the side um, windows and let's see how many shots it will take. So all there already is two there, uh, three. So it takes three shots until it does shatter let's see what happens here until it does make a hole four five and six oh i got run over right so six bullets until there's no hole right now seven eight nine ten eleven so it takes 11 shots until it actually produces a hole in the glass which personally I think that is very good because if someone is shooting you from the side then obviously you are not going to die straight away uh, if they are using a pistol. Now let's see what uh, this little window can do for you. So one, two, the heck, oh you bitch. Obviously, here's a window that doesn't protect him. So, one, two, three. Has that shattered yet? No. Four, five, six, seven. Wait, seven. So, it takes seven shots until the side window does actually shatter. Which, personally, I think that is also very good. So,. Oh, that window is really small, so I doubt people gonna start shooting through that window. But now let's see if the tires are bulletproof. I would expect them to be bulletproof since it is actually a Pegasus vehicle, because mostly Pegasus vehicles are actually bulletproof. So it does actually seem to be that they are bulletproof. Now let's test the brakes. I know this isn't gonna be a very long video, but this is basically all me. This is basically just me testing out the MTL Doom. Right, so I'm going to get some speed here, not very fast. Let's see how long it takes for it to actually stop. So, three, two, one. So, that took about, say, two to three seconds till it, it did actually stop, which is actually re very good, to be honest, because, say, if you bought the Obey 9F, uh, the Audi R8 in real life that is actually I think that is actually very good I think the NTL Doom will actually beat that in braking power because um, yeah that break did, that did actually break very fast but um, personally I think this is a very nice truck I think it is better than the uh, the truck that you do for missions when you have to carry uh, packages or like um, yeah basically packages to your warehouse that you, you have to use in missions but um, yeah guys that's all there is to it that was me reviewing the 
NTL Doom. So yeah, if you did like the video, please leave a like. And tell my channel to go in the future, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.